Hey my lovely Leos, welcome to your love reading. If you're new, welcome. Please remember to subscribe and hit the notification bell so you get all the messages I post each month to my lovely loyal subscribers. Welcome back. I'll leave information regarding what decks of cards I use and how to contact me for personal readings in the description box. So go ahead and check that out there guys. Okay, Leos, let's see what's going on with the love messages for Leos. The Fool and the Magician here. Um, so the Magician reversed the Fool. Um, I feel like it's not quite time um, to meet this person or something. You could have just been going through a breakup um, because this Magician reversed here. Um, it's like the magician usually has all the tools on the table ready to manifest so it might be that you're not quite ready for to jump here yet nine of wands yeah uh, defenses are up so this person or you could have seven of swords um, if you was dealing with somebody who cheated on you they could have blocked you here so they're not ready for this uh, situation to manifest um, it might be that they met somebody new even here. Let's see what's going on then. King of Cups, okay. With the Magician reversed, the Strength card. Um, they think you've moved on. They was led away by temptation and they think you've moved on because of this betrayal. It's probably that Scorpio, right, Leos, that you guys have been dealing with. So they think you've moved on. Let's see. Yeah, let's see here where, where you're moving on to. You probably had no choice, really, right? If somebody cheats on you, blocks you. Yeah, we see the block in here again. Um, this person is really upset now um, because of their own actions, right? What can you do about that? They blocked you out. They did whatever um threw away what was meant to be in that sort of situation uh they had a very hard lesson to learn at this moment um this can be somebody quite uh, emotionally abusive as well plays with your feelings here with that king of cups reversed oh let's see let's hope the cards that come out are a lot better than this that's happening right now because definitely they're upset um but <laughs> this is somebody who blocked you after they cheated and like <laughs> okay <laughs> seven of swords okay leo's nine of wands let's look at this cheat then right uh just the cards we obviously seen um they want a chance with you um but they understood what they did now Four of Cups, so they're not going to make an offer. Um, this is almost, I hate to say it, like um, cowardly. And of course, cross watchers, it can be a Leo who did this to you, so it would be the Leo then that would have be feeling cowardly. Um, just remember, there's all different vibrations of sun signs, and there's more to a person than just their sun sign. Um, here this person cheated ghosted thought they'd go have a new beginning that didn't work out here this four of cups they're like okay well i'll jump and it seemed like you was their security blanket so when they jumped it's like realizing damn it what do i do now um i took an opportunity this is not working out how i expected it to be i thought there'd be I guess more out here. I thought there was something out here that I was looking for, but it's back there and it's realizing halfway down after you've jumped. The hangman reversed. They refused to open their eyes here. They refused to open their eyes until it was like halfway down and then it got scary while jumping halfway down. Um, I feel like they're now stuck. Um, this person, until you open your eyes, you know, you're not going to see anything, clearly. Um, but 
they were stuck. It's like emptying out their emotions here. King of Swords. Um, they, how do you get to a point where you think being cold, being distant um, is the way forward? Actually, the way forward is communication, fairness, being honest, being just. Whether it's hurtful to you or them, it, you've just got to have that honesty, right? That truth will cut you down out of this tree where you're stuck. Okay, they fear falling on the ground. If I say the truth, I'm going to hit the floor hard. It's going to hurt me instead of them. So this is somebody who, choose, who chose to hurt you instead of hurting themselves, right? I feel like they're very high in ego here. They did something stupid out of boredom was temptation, desire, those sorts of things. Thinking they're missing out on something in life and then realizing halfway down, damn, I messed up, but not admitting it to themselves. That's the hangman there, rever reverse. Not admitting it to the yourself that you messed up. Queen of Swords. Mm, it's like losing the one. It's like the one I was meant to be with here. This is usually my twin flame cards. Um, but this is losing somebody who did everything right for you, put love into you, wanted to, you know, do the best for you and be honest with you. And it reminds me when Rihanna says, you know, you know, I dealt with you the nicest. <laughs> That's like, you dealt with them the nicest and they jumped and realized halfway down that they messed up. Still very cold energy in this reading though. Seven of Swords, the King of Swords, the Queen of Swords reversed. <clears throat> it's almost like you knew, so you could have reached out and wanted to talk to them at one point, but they was cold and distant towards you. Now it might be that the roles are reversed. You're no longer interested that four of cups, so you're no longer interested in their offer. What they have to say is kind of a bit of pill to swallow to realize that you're the one after you're halfway down from jumping and you're realizing, look, I'm, I, I was always the one that caught you. Two of cups reversed. You realize that it's, it's not only about lying, deception and cheating and those sorts of things. Because, you know, not always that seven of swords is about what it first appears to be. It can be low self-esteem. It can be those negative thoughts in your head. It can even be outside influences saying to you, go ahead and do it, go ahead and do it. But at the end of the day, we all have free will to choose, right? So this is like somebody realizing I lost my soulmate. Somebody realizes they lost you. Nine of Swords. <clears throat> this is self-awareness, right? I did this. I caused this. They can even, if they're not saying this to you, um, this is what's going on within them right now. If they're saying this to you, I probably, I probably feel like you're not interested in what they have to say. It might be like, okay, just tell me that one more time and then you block them because they blocked you when you was trying to reach out to them to find out what was going on, get clarity in this situation. Nine of swords here, so they're, they're not sleeping well. They're not sleeping well and I kind of hate to say it, it's kind of karma. It's we reap what we sow. They sowed this for themselves. So what can anybody do? It, it doesn't, it's not about right and wrong, it's about we sow, right? And then we reap. So however you're reacting to their love now is 
what they reaped. And I am very well aware that there are some people over here who are at the stage of this person has just blocked me and I'm looking for an answer or I'm trying to make this Four of Cups offer to them and they're not seeing it, they're rejecting it. They refuse to see your offer. This is why they had to go to the extent of blocking. It's like somebody who can't accept that you're right or you was right. So they'd rather not see it at all. And then when they finally, and then they're stuck until they open up their eyes until they see. I lost my frigging soulmate here. They're not sleeping or they're having nightmares. Five of Swords. Reversed. I think it's been a long time since I've had this many reversals in the read, in a reading and we've seen the Magician reversed and it's not quite being there yet to be able to manifest. And that's now we see why because of the Hanged Man reversed. There's not a full awakening here. So those of you who have fully awoke and are rejecting their offers, you are at the sort of spiritual stage of knowing your worth and not letting, you're the king of swords and you know that you're not gonna let people disrespect your boundaries, okay? The queens are um, also have a lot to offer, but sometimes they give too much, right? they you're at the king of swords energy that is a higher vibration this person if they are sorry because i was their soulmate i you understand all that those of you who might be at the beginning stages might be giving a little bit too much to this person who isn't giving to you because we can see the two of cups reversed we can see the four of cups reversed they're ignoring here and they're trying to, with the Five of Swords, it's not that it's a lose-lose situation. They're trying to avoid conflict. They don't want to know they was wrong at this point. Um, so your per that's why your person isn't manifesting already yet. Let's see if we can get some clarity on this situation. Retreat, getting to know each other as we reveal your innermost selves to each other, your bond deepens. Uh, you're getting to know yourself here. It's These nines is related to the hermit. Um, it's about yourself and it's about their self, what they're going through. They have to go through it alone. Their retreat is time to disconnect from the world. So if you're not interested in this person who cheated on you or this person, if you're at the beginning stages, you still want to give this relationship a chance. You're making an offer that's falling on deaf ears here. Um, so just being aware that the hanged man is reversed. The magician was reversed. The two of cups is reversed. Five of swords being reversed. It's not, it, it could of course be you that's not sleeping, having anxiety because this person has blocked you, isn't talking to you, um, won't give you any sort of clarity. Um, don't worry, they realise after that they made a mistake, they just don't want to admit it here. Release your ex, the time has come to clear your energy. Make the effort, great love is worth taking the steps you're guided to take, right? So, it's if you are at the beginning of this, um, you need to clear your energy of what has been and focus on yourself and healing yourself, okay? Release your ex doesn't mean that um, you know, you'll never get this opportunity to be with them again if that's what you want. Um, but it's saying, look, make the effort. If you believe that this person's worth it and this love is worth it, because I'm not about just throwing away love, you know, um, if you believe they're worth it, go ahead and make the effort to heal yourself and they'll do the same. You can't change somebody else. So if you really believe it's worth it, focus on healing yourself and loving yourself. Um, and for those of you who are quite literally releasing your ex, you understand here to love yourself first, exactly what I was talking about, right? Um, you deserve love and you're understanding, you deserve better for those of you who understand this person rather than, it's not even about making a mistake, it's about once you make the mistake and 
not admitting it to yourself firstly, um, then there's a problem, right? There's an issue. So this is what you've got to do and got to understand. And this is, I think those of you who have already experienced this, understand this now. Those of you who are just at the beginning of this, and please remember to be gentle with each other in the comments. That's why I keep my comments open so that those of you who have experienced hurt and things like that before, you can offer love and help to your fellow humans, right? Not just fellow Leos, it's fellow humans. I've seen beautiful people, um, you know, offer encouragement in the comments. And sometimes that's all it takes, a stranger saying, hang on in there, love yourself to make a real change in somebody's life. This person realizes you're the one after they jumped. We do make mistakes as humans, but it's what we do after the mistakes. Do we learn from them or do we pretend we never made them? That's what you need to be asking yourself, guys. Is that what they're doing? Is this who they are? Good luck, guys.